For more than 100 years, as South Florida's coastline was developed, acres upon acres of mangroves were destroyed in the process. In recent years, we've begun to understand just how vital mangroves are to protecting our shores and cleaning up our waterways. And two brothers recognized that and launched a company with the goal of restoring the world's lost mangroves. And they're doing it by selling hats and shirts, planting one mangrove at a time. Local 10's Louie Aguirre has tonight's Don't Trash Our Treasure. As the sun rose over the historic lighthouse on the Jupiter Inlet, a team of dedicated volunteers begins to plant the first of a thousand baby mangroves on an eroding shore where these ancient trees once dominated the coastline. We are putting backwards once here and we are using natural elements to stabilize eroding shorelines. Red mangroves, the first line of defense against storm surge and sea level rise nature's carbon sinks that suck up greenhouse gases and provide critical habitat for birds and marine life while filtering out sediment and pollution. These mangroves, they're the future stability of our economy. They're protecting our ecosystems, they're protecting our shorelines, they're protecting our community for the future. That's why 30-year-old twin brothers Keith and Kyle Rawson are on an urgent mission to plant as many mangroves as they can. Mangroves add value to our shorelines. Together, they created an outdoor apparel brand, Mang, with a commitment to plant one mangrove for every product they sell. Buy one, plant one. It all started with our passion uh, to, to protect the environment. The seed was planted six years ago inside their mother's garage that today is still an overflow space for inventory. So we do offer both a women's fit and a men's fit, youth and toddler. Their first product, a trucker hat that soon flowered into a line of high performance UPF 50 shirts designed by Keith and their aunt Sherry. That's beautiful, I like the turtle a lot. While in mom's backyard, a mangrove nursery began to flourish. How many mangroves do you have? Roughly 20,000. Um, the, the nursery cycles through about 10,000 years, so each year we run an annual profitable collection campaign. Together with volunteers, the brothers collect red mangrove propagules floating in waterways, then plant and grow them here until they're big enough to be transplanted where they're needed most. We look at these as our children. You know, these are, <laughs> these are our next generation for, for our fisheries, for our coastlines. Their first mangrove restoration project was back in 2016 in the Earman River in Palm Beach County. Now, six years later, they've grown Mang into a multi-million dollar company and have planted over 377,000 mangroves worldwide. They're really, at the end of the day, what keeps us protected here in the state and what keeps Florida's coastlines looking like the shape of Florida. Keith has a degree in horticulture, Kyle in environmental studies. Together, they conduct the symphony of volunteers strategically planting the young mangroves along the shore of the Jupiter Inlet, where these small trees are sure to thrive. I live here, I fish here, and it's gonna make me happy to come by in our boat and see the mangroves that I planted out here every day. And in just under two hours, all 1,000 baby mangroves were planted. Two hours ago, this was an eroded shoreline. Now it's green, it's beautiful, it's habitat. All thanks to two brothers who vowed to change the world one mangrove at a time. Six years ago, I couldn't have imagined doing a project at the Jupiter Lighthouse. It fills my heart up to know that we're building something that's greater than us, that's a legacy that will live on beyond us, and I will be thrilled to know that we had an impact on the community here in, in Jupiter. Quite an impact indeed. This past weekend, the Mang Brothers planted 2,200 red mangroves in Grand Bahama. In December, they'll be planting mangroves in Costa Rica, just as they have here in Florida, Madagascar, Mozambique, the Philippines, and Honduras. If you'd like to learn more about Mang and how you can be a part of this mission, we have that link on local10.com. Just scan that QR code right there on your screen. It'll take you right to the Don't Trash Our Treasure section. So inspiring, these two.